What are you looking at? Real tough guy. Welcome to another Cheap Game Reviews. Uh, sorry that it's been so long since I've actually um, done a recording, but I've been busy working on a project. I'll put the link in the sidebar, wherever that sidebar is now. Uh, or the doobly-doo. The game that I've chosen to play and show you guys today is Prey for the PC. I picked up this game from Game Traders at like $10. Uh, I played this on Xbox 360 initially and I really liked it and so I'm just going to show you the sample of like the beginning levels, a couple of the basic kind of stuff. Um, but it is, in my opinion, a pretty sweet game. Let's get into it. The storyline is based on that you're not a Native American and you're not really keen to the whole like, your whole background, your whole history and stuff like that. You know I don't go for that shit. Listen, Tommy. You cannot turn your back on your heritage any longer. But the person you're in love with is, and you're trying to pull her out of that. You think about what I said? Tommy, not this again. Come away with me. Just for a few days. Off the reservation. Why can't we just be together here? You know why. I hate this place. And just as you're, you know, trying to resolve that conflict, aliens come and take her away. And to cleanse the lands of all living things. Um, and you have to go save them. Quite a straightforward story. Next, uh, the gameplay elements. Now, this actually for me is probably one of the better elements of this game because it's just so intense. Some people won't like it. I've been talking to a few people about this, but um, yeah, I find that yeah, it's just it, the, the map takes you upside down, takes you all over the world, trips you out completely, and then then you got to shoot some things in the in the meantime. Just to let you guys know, uh, this game was made in 2006 by, well, a collaboration of 2K and 3D Realms. A little bit controversial nowadays. The sound design of this game is actually, it's really superb. It's really twisted, once again, it, the sounds are so disgusting and it's so, yeah, and raw. Um, but that's the point of the game, that's the whole idea. Uh, so it kind of works for it. What the hell is that? <laughs> Also, the music fits, the score fits quite nicely, it's quite majestic. I, I do really like the music in the game. Uh, it doesn't really stand out, but I do actually enjoy the music in the game. That felt weird. Jeez, uh, what else can I talk about? What else can I... Um... Ah... Uh. Uh, the basic premise of the game, uh, when it comes to the gameplay kind of way, is that you're essentially just shooting things. There is no reload, there is no kind of, but you're using alien technology and you're shooting kind of alien y, well, they're aliens, but they're kind of monster alien thingies. <laughs> Yeah, the system is, is quite straightforward, except for that once you get to the teleporting and the, the walking along roofs and all that stuff, like that's where it gets really confusing. And that's where I think some you, you might lose some of the gamers. Um, but it all really depends on how much you really enjoy the, the story. If you're really kind of keen to finding out the ending, which I'm not going to tell you. Another really cool gameplay feature is the... You kind of... Your, your falcon, that was your kind of spirit, allows you to take your soul out of your body and transport it across like you know certain doors and rooms and things like that to unlock things or pick up items and stuff good which is actually a pretty cool feature same with your like pretty sweet ass bow which you you power with souls that's right with souls Anyway guys, um, yeah, just pick it up if you're really keen on it, uh, just look around, it's not very hard to find, I think you'd definitely be able to find it online, and um, yeah, just don't forget to rate and subscribe, and have yourself a great day.